Do you want to know what happens in a real press trip to attend the runway show in another city? Welcome, Welcome to, to La Gazette. Gazette! In today's video, we take you along on our day trip from Paris to Amsterdam to attend the Natan runway show and discover the Spring-Summer 2021 collection. You'll learn all about the brand from the creative director himself as we go to go backstage to interview him before the show. And stay until the end for some updates of our first La Gazette trip. Y como siempre, recuerda que tenemos subtítulos en español. Y nous vous rappelons que nous avons également des sous-titres en français. The first stop in our road to Amsterdam was actually in the Saint-Germain neighborhood, in the left bank of Paris. We visited the Nathan boutique as they were kind enough to lend us a great look to attend the show. This is what's called a fitting. Brands will sometimes lend journalists, influencers and celebrities looks from their current collection to wear to the runway of their next one, so street style photographers can catch them wearing the same brand that invited them. A fitting can take place in a brand's showroom or, like today, in the brand's boutique. As you can see, we have chosen our outfits. We're super happy. Uh, I went with uh, color blocking in neutral colors, which is very Natan, uh, especially the color blocking. And this top is also quintessentially Natan. <laughs> and I have a dress, a beige dress. I love it because it has some pockets, so I can put everything for my trip to Amsterdam. Yeah, and we chose the same palette to go a little combined to arrive as a team to Amsterdam. And also, before we forget, <laughs> we chose some masks to be matched with our outfits. Yeah, Nathan, I have still masks. <laughs> we'll see you there. And we're ready for the trip. This is what you do for fashion. <laughs> so this is Gambino. You might recognize this place and this train station from Gossip Girl where Blair and Chuck <laughs> um, had a scene together. From Gare du Nord, we take the TGV to Amsterdam, really, really early, a bit too early. <laughs> the trip is three and a half hours. In the train, we meet our group, which includes the Nathan PR. She gives us our invite to the show and our lovely Nathan mask with a personal message from Edouard, the creative director of the brand. We have time for a little nap and to check our emails before we arrived at Amsterdam Central Station. I love press trips because they're like school trips. You feel like a, like a kid again. We're the little group with the teacher that tells us where to go. We walk to the ferry to cross the canal and get to the restaurant where we'd be having lunch. We were so lucky the weather was this nice. It was one of the last good days of the season. By the way, if you're enjoying this unique access to what's really like to go to a fashion show in another city, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to your channel and hit the notifications bell. Okay, back to the trip. I almost got troubled by a bike. <laughs> it's colder than what we thought. In this hotel, we got to have a nice lunch with the group and change out of our train clothes. Hello guys! As you can see, we have already changed from our train clothes into our Natan total look, including masks, and we are about to go to the show. We are here in the iFilm Museum and we are about to go interview the designer, see the collection and go to the backstage. Let's go! Come on! We got early access to the show, as normally foreign press gets a bit of a special treatment during smaller fashion weeks. I assure you this never happens in Paris. <laughs> Once inside, we got a sneak peek into the collection as we arrived when models were doing their final rehearsal. And we discovered even more looks as we stepped backstage for our interview with Eduard Bermulen. We're here with the designer of Natan, uh, Monsieur Edouard. Hello. <laughs> nice welcome, to meet you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. 
thank, thank you, you for much. having us. And yeah. thank you for dressing up. We yeah, <laughs> love welcome. our looks. You're great, you're great, because I love this girl. And uh, I love beige, you can well. see it on the, uh, <laughs> on the show. We, we love to. Colors. <laughs> colors. Well, we have a worldwide audience, so we wanted to know if you could define the essence of Nathan in some words. Feminine, that's for me the most important. Couture, timeless, and contemporary. And what were your inspirations for this collection? You see uh, flowers, uh, uh, natural fabrics, uh, much color. It's very positive. Yes, it must be positive in yes. this car. That's, that's for me so important because I say when it starts with the rise of COVID, I say but the, pro the problem is today that we, we need to go over it and that we bring something else to the client. So we have a future <laughs> when uh, we are living with flowers and a better way. Sunshine. Creatively, you managed to put together a very positive collection, even though the times were, were a little bit bleak. So how was the process for you? Uh, but the process, uh, we start with the, with the fabrics before mm -hmm. the price, because we do, ah. we, we do the choice yes. of everything in January. Mm -hmm. And then after, uh, we start with the, with the design of it, with the sketches, and uh, then it was, it was not such a, such a problem, because uh, for us, the summer collection must be ready uh, on June. Yes. You, you start the collection in uh, January and we stop a little bit in half of March. Uh, uh, why do you choose to show at Amsterdam? I mean because it's a new fashion week and uh, I think it's uh, we have a shop in Maastricht. We have a lot of clients, multi-brands in Netherlands. We have uh, Amsterdam, Maastricht, two shops and a lot of clients because they have a shop now in Paris, uh, Rue des Saint-Père. We yes. start just before the price, that was a little bit difficult. But enfin, I hope with this collection and the wind collection everything is going better. And we're sure it will, as the collection was truly uplifting. Let's clap for the finale. And there's Edouard taking his final bow. So that was it for the Nathan show. We hope you enjoyed it, guys. Now it's time for us to go change out of our Cinderella clothes, back into our train clothes and back to Paris. Don't forget to like and comment in this video if you like it and to subscribe to Like I Said for more fashion. See you next time, guys. We hope you enjoyed this special access to a day in the life of a fashion journalist traveling to cover a runway show. We had a blast and we want to thank Nathan for having us. If you want to learn more about the fashion industry and have access like never before, subscribe to Legazette and hit the notifications bell. And you can also follow us on Instagram and TikTok for more fashion. Thanks for watching! Okay, we promised you bloopers, but there's really just one major blooper that we wanted to share with you because it's so damn funny. You may recognize this place from um, Gossip Girl where Blair and Blake Wait. And Chuck. I don't know, Gary. Get his black.